Hi friends, welcome to TurboMaz channel. Many people when they see this question don't know which operation to do first. So, they often make a mistake and they might get it wrong. For example, some people solve this question like this. They say 10 minus 2 equals 8. 8 times 3 to the power of 2 which equals 9, then plus 8, then divided by 2 to the power of 3 which equals 8. 8 times 9 equals 72. 72 plus 8, then divided by 8. 72 plus 8 equals 80, and 80 divided by 8 equals 10. But this answer is definitely wrong. Let's solve this question a step by a step together. To solve this question, we need to follow the PEMDAS rule. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations. And if you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. We must to follow this rule from top to bottom. In this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. Multiplication and division have the same level of priority, also addition and subtraction have the same level of priority. And when we have both in an expression, we start from the left and simplify the question. In this question, we have subtraction, multiplication, exponent, addition, and division. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify the exponent. 3 to the power of 2 equals 9, and 2 to the power of 3 equals 8. Now the question is 10 minus 2, then times 9, plus 8, divided by 8. Now we have subtraction, multiplication, addition, and division. First, we simplify the multiplication. Negative 2 times 9 equals negative 18. Now we have 10 minus 18 plus 8, then divided by 8. In this step, we have subtraction, addition, and division. First, we simplify this division. 8 divided by 8 equals 1. Now we have 10 minus 18, then plus 1. 10 minus 18 equals negative 8. And negative 8 plus 1 equals negative 7. The final answer of this question equals negative 7. Okay guys, if you're ready, let's solve another question about PEMDAS rule. In this question, we have 8 times 7 minus 5 divided by 5, then plus 5, then divided by 6 minus 6 divided by 6. Can you solve this question? Let's simplify this question and solve it a step by step together. We have 8 times 7 minus 5 divided by 5, then plus 5 in the numerator, and in the denominator we have 6 minus 6, then divided by 6. Okay guys, to solve this question, we need to follow the PEMDAS rule. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify the parentheses. Inside the first parentheses, we have multiplication, subtraction, division, and addition. First we do this multiplication. 8 times 7 equals 56. Now we have 56 minus 5 divided by 5, then plus 5. Now we do this division. Negative 5 divided by 5 equals negative 1. Now we have 56 minus 1, then plus 5. 56 minus 1 equals 55. And 55 plus 5 equals 60. The answer of first parenthesis equals 60. Now we have 60 divided by 6 minus 6, then divided by 6. Okay, guys. In the second parenthesis, we have subtraction and division. First, we do this division, because the division has higher priority than subtraction. Negative 6 divided by 6 equals negative 1. Now we have 6 minus 1 in the second parenthesis, and the question is 60 divided by 6 minus 1. 
6 minus 1 equals 5 and 6c divided by 5 equals 12. The final answer of this question equals 12. Thanks for watching guys. Please subscribe to the channel and leave a comment. Goodbye.